Israel confirms it launched a retaliatory strike against a Hezbollah commander in Beirut Tuesday. Israeli Defense Forces claim the commander is responsible for killing 12 children and teens in Israel-controlled Golan Heights as they played soccer Saturday. Hezbollah denied it was behind the attack. But Israel argues Hezbollah is the only militant group in the region that possesses the kind of rocket used in the strike. Monday, the White House said Hezbollah was undeniably behind the attack, but warned Israel against striking Beirut or major civil infrastructure in Lebanon over fears it could lead to an all-out war. Despite the warning, Israel struck inside the capital city. Smoke could be seen rising above buildings after the attack. The area is reportedly a heavily populated area of Beirut and a stronghold of Hezbollah. Since the war in Gaza, Israel and the Iranian-backed militant group have exchanged fire across Israel's northern border. For Straight Arrow News, I'm Lauren Taylor. For more on this developing situation in Lebanon, download the Straight Arrow News app.